Hello everyone. In this video, you're going to see how we can download different operating system images so we can use them for workstation booting disk or for the virtual machine. We're going to download Fedora, RHEL, Red Hat Linux, and Microsoft Windows image. And we're going to verify them through checksum. Be sure to like my video and subscribe to my channel. So without further ado, let's get started. First image we're going to take a look at is Fedora. You want to go to getfedora.org and we can download workstation server, but we're going to use this work server. So we can use it one for x86-64 and click download. Once we download the images, we can go to verify your download. They will provide the checksum. Depending on your operating system, you may use a different tool, but you can download this file and then we can use them to verify. So we have a checksum file and ISO file for Fedora in the same directory and we can print out the checksum. We're going to verify this later. So we're going to use a tool called SHASUM S -H -A -S -U -M, and you want to, this is command. For the your operating system it might be different for a netbook is this is a command and then it will print out the content with the command it'll take a little while so once we got the result we can just compare against the checksum file we downloaded and you we can see that they're the same now we're going to see the process for rail Red Hat Enterprise Linux, how to download. For the checksum and other process, it will be pretty much similar. So we're gonna not gonna talk about here, but you just can use the same process as we've seen before. So we go to assess.redhat.com, you need to have a subscription. So once you're logged in, we are gonna go to Red Hat Enterprise Linux. So we're gonna select download the latest and it will bring to the rail page. We can download the one for the wood ISO, but we can we're going to download the guest images for KVM, which is in QCow2 images. As you can see there to check some. So you once you download the images, you can run the same SHA sum tool to verify against this uh, checksum code. As a last thing we are going to download Microsoft Windows. We are going to download Microsoft Windows Server 2019, but if you want to use other thing, you can do that as well. We are going to download one with the evaluation period with of 90 days. But if you have other Microsoft Windows product to use with the correct license, you can use that as well. So we are going to go to Microsoft.com and here you can search for the product. We're gonna type Windows 2019. And we're gonna click Explore. And there will be the link to take to Evaluation Center. So go click that. So once you're here, you can fill out the de detail. We can select ISO and we can fill out the details here. Once you fill out the form, you're gonna select the language and you can you will bring to the download link. You can download the images or from open virtualization. There's also a way to import directly using HTTP. So you can use that as well. That's it. Thank you for watching. Be sure to like my video and subscribe to my channel. Don't forget. And hopefully we can see you again next time. Bye bye.